The current real-time XRP price is $0.5168. Its trading volume is $918,646,552 in the last 24 hours. XRP price has plummeted by 3.34% in the last day and increased by 4% in the last day and increased by 4.88% in the last seven days. It's important to note that the current XRP market capitalization is $28 billion and the maximum supply is 100 billion XRP coins. Talking about circulating supply, XRP is 55,235,913,166 coins. Currently, XRP rank on the market is 7. XRP price today is 30.30% below the time high, and it is 18,341.67% above the time low. Today, we are going to talk about the United States State Securities and Exchange Commission has filed its final response to its ongoing lawsuit against Ripple. Crypto enthusiasts, welcome back to Crypto Educate channel. Your support is precious to me. Kindly like my video, make this video go viral by sharing it, comment, and watch to the end. Thank you. Without wasting time, let's dive into the topic. According to the filing, the commission has refuted Ripple's claims that it acted without recklessness in handling the XRP cryptocurrency. The regulator pointed out that the court had previously dismissed Ripple's fair notice defense despite the firm's assertion of no widespread uncertainty regarding XRP's legal status. Uh, further, the SEC drew attention to Ripple's attempts to minimize its liability by highlighting its cooperation with regulatory authorities since the initial coin offering of XRP in 2013. However, the regulator argued that Ripple's compliance does not eliminate the possibility of future violations. The filing went on to add that Ripple's claims of restructuring future XRP sales and adhering to legal advice are misleading and do not accurately reflect the judicial orders. It asserted that Ripple had misinterpreted these orders and underestimated their compliance implications. The SEC also dismissed Ripple's defenses regarding XRP sales outside the U.S. and to accredited investors. The commission noted that these arguments were not sustained during summary judgment. On top of this, the commission rejected Ripple's adjustments to contracts for on-demand liquidity sales pointing out that these revised contracts still lack necessary restrictions, hence continuing to pose legal risks. Ultimately, the SEC maintains that, despite Ripple's reassurances and absence of recent violations, the potential for future breaches exists. As such, it argues that this possibility justifies the need for injunctions to ensure Ripple's compliance going forward, the agency's response wasn't well received within the crypto community with Ripple's chief legal officer, Stuart Alderodi, criticizing its approach. Per Alderodi, the SEC's actions would be puzzling for other financial regulators that have established or are working on creating a regulatory framework for the crypto sector. If you are a financial regulator outside the U.S., and have done the hard work of establishing comprehensive crypto licensing frameworks, know that the SEC has no respect for you and thinks you are handing out the equivalent of phishing licenses, he wrote. On April 23rd, a Ripple challenged the SEC's $1.95 billion penalty imposed for the institutional sales of XRP. The regulator has proposed $876 million for disgorgement, $198 million for prejudgment interest and a civil penalty of $876 million. However, Ripple has claimed that the civil fine cannot exceed $10 million. If we look at this chart, Ripple completed the corrective linking wave XX as a double zigzag WXY. Then, the initial part of a new double zigzag began to form. The actionary wave W, consisting of subwaves ABC, has been completed Soon, expect a fall in the final impulse subwave C of the zigzag linking wave X to the level of 0.473. At this level, wave X will be 61.8% of wave W. Trading plan for XRP USD today sell 0.516, take profit 0.473. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not financial advice. Make sure you do your own research here. Let's look at BTC chart. Bitcoin is forming a corrective wave four consisting of subwaves WXYXXZ. The second linking wave XX is currently unfolding. Inside wave XX, 
impulse subwave has been completed. Now the price is declining as part of correction B. The price may fall to the level of 61,281.85, at which wave B will be 50% of wave A. Trading plan for BTCUSD today, you can sell 62,623.01 and take profit 61,281.85. If we look at this E chart, the ETH USD market continues to build a correction for as a double zigzag WXY. Within this pattern, subwaves WX have been completed. Shortly expect the formation of the linking wave XX within which the actionary wave W has come to an end. Thus soon expect a fall in subwave X. Wave X will be 61.8% of wave W. Thus, the price will drop to the level of 2,940.22 dollars. The trading plan for ETHUSD for today sell 3,022.60 and take profit 2,940.22. This is not financial advice. Make sure you do your own research. XRP is firm, but within a very narrow range following a day of inactivity on May 7th. Impressively, prices are still within the May 6th range of bullish signal. As XRP trends above $0.52, Traders expect a possible extension today. Even so, before then, a close above $0.55, recent weakness would cement the bull's position, setting the coin for $0.60 zero the weeks ahead. Amid upbeat holders, XRP is down 3% in the last 24 hours, but up 6% in the previous week. The failure of immediate gains yesterday has impacted sentiment, which is reflected in the narrow trade range. Overall, the average trading volume in the past day is down 37% to slightly more than $1.1 billion. Meanwhile, traders are keeping track of the following Ripple and XRP News, a redacted public version of the remedies brief submitted by the United States SEC will be available today. This reply is crucial and highlights, among others, the justification presented by the regulator on why they want Ripple to pay a $2 billion fine. Brad Garlinghouse, the CEO of Ripple, has once again reiterated that XRP and ETH are not securities. Speaking on a fireside chat, the executive said the regulator is grossly wrong on its position. The conclusion of the three-year case versus the United States SEC will provide clarity on the state of XRP. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to stop here for now and remember that financial markets are unpredictable. Experts can be wrong in their predictions. Therefore, it is important to do your own due diligence before investing and never invest more than what you can afford to lose. The chaotic price movements can humble even the smartest and most experienced players. Thanks for watching my video. Keep supporting my channel. See you all in my next video.